Come on. Is this the third floor? What's up, mister? There was another door as well below, but... Nothing. The tree blocking the freight elevator is gone. I must have changed the past. Well, yeah, but... Is this where Lily... Forget I said anything. Noel, have you been here before? They used to research living things affected by the particle contamination here. I mean, this is where Maya and I were helping out with the professor's experiments. Hmm. How we need to get the main elevator up and running and reach the top floor. Let's go and check it out. We have this tree here. We went up. Okay, so I still have the chance to go here. It's like the transition here was that we went with an elevator straight from below, I think. That's what happened because we repaired everything. Oof. This stuff can get confusing. Hal, we need to hurry up and get the elevator unlocked. Let's head to the monitor room. I wonder if I would do it earlier. I would be able. God damn it. Give me a second. Executing security check. Administrative sector access granted. Great work, Noel! The controls are back online! Do you think the elevator's good to go now? It should be. Let's take a look. Okay, I thought I missed it then. There's no way through! We'll have to find another way around. We might be able to get through via the room over there! Why don't you take a look at the door? The door? Oh my god. We don't have much choice. Let's head inside. Hal? Am I imagining things? Or was Noel acting kinda shifty just now? More than usual. Do you think there's something on this floor he's trying to hide from us? Don't. It's dangerous inside. Mutagen cloning laboratory. That can be kinda juicy. No, like I said, we don't have a choice. There aren't any other routes. Hmm. Besides, we can always turn back if it isn't safe. Where are we?
We saw something like this at the professor's house, right? Yeah, kinda. We saw some... Who was that? This plushie looks kind of familiar. I swear I've seen one just like it somewhere. Professor, when's Lily gonna wake up? Oh, not long now. She's already conscious. She has a person inside? So she can hear me? She can. Lily, it's almost time to wake up. I got you a present. It's right here in this box. Oh, and the professor built you a super special friend. Maya, the Zeta isn't ready yet. Oh. But I thought you said they were already linked together. Indeed, thanks to the particle system, their bond is incredibly strong. The Zeta will keep Lily safe, no matter the circumstances. Huh. In the memory I just saw, was that Lily and the Zeta? Maya and the Professor both called the baby in the pod Lily. Why, though? How? Something dropped out of the plushie! Yeah, out of his ass. <laughs> hmm. Looks like a key. We might fit it in the lab as well. I think it's exactly the same. This seems like something a kid might wear. On what? It's just like my bill! Oh yeah. Warning. Structural instability detected. Brace for strong tremors. What's happening? What should I do? I need to keep Lily safe. Maya! It's cold! Where are we? Lily. Lily. Well, we saw this memory already. Lily, I, I couldn't save you. I'm so sorry. When was that just now? Maya. What you gonna hit me, Professor? There's no time. You're in grave danger here. Take Lily with you and run as fast as you can. I thought she wasn't ready to come out of her pod yet. I'll transfer her consciousness to the Zeta. 
It's a simple enough procedure. Okay. Wait! You can't! Maya, listen to me. This place isn't safe anymore. If anything happens to the pot, Lily's consciousness will be lost forever. If it gets too dangerous, I'll take her with me. Professor, please? Let's hold off as long as we can. So be it. Maya, I need to override the core system at the top of the tower. If I can stop Sonya, we'll be able to save Lily too. Ah, I'm a little bit confused. Really? Which is nothing new. <laughs> I'm sure of it. Promise me one thing though. If this place starts to collapse, Take Lily and get out of here before it's too late. Do I make myself clear? That was Maya's memory. So Lily's consciousness got transferred to the Zeta. Uh, uh. All the equipment here was damaged when the tower went rampant back then. They had to transfer the clone's consciousness to the Zeta. But Lily was supposed to be born as Maya's little sister. Hell. <laughs> How? What's wrong? Oh, it's nothing. Oh yeah, sure. Eh? If I could stop the accident that happened 12 years ago, would Lily end up being born as a human? I don't know. <laughs> Did Noel know what happened here? Now might be a good time to ask him about it. Well, little guy, time to explain yourself. <sighs> ah. But clone of what, like? Oh, there it is, Mia Ramford. supposed to be born as a human, wasn't she? They used to keep her body safe in the pod here. Yeah. She's our little sister. She was supposed to wake up here. Oh, she's not the same. Maya and I were so excited, but then the clock tower malfunctioned. Hmm. Ever met my mom? The professor told me about her when I was a kid. He said he'd rescued a variant from the east. I never got to meet her though. She was helping out with the research they were doing at the top of the clock tower. There's no way they'd have ever let us in. Hell, promise me you won't mention anything you saw here to Lily. I mean, she's here. Come on, let's go. Messy. And there's something about the bell.
weird. My vision is kind of... What's going on? Is this because what happened 12 years ago is being overwritten? Yeah. If the professor were to make it to the top of the tower back then, what would happen to me? Well, you disappear, no? That's the plan? <laughs> Al? You look terrible. It's like you're... I'm fine. been waiting for me this whole time. She must have seen a future where I never came to the city. The tower went rampant 12 years ago. Lily passed away, and I woke up. There must be other futures where things turn out differently. Let's go. 